This is Frank Taylor, Nature at Your Door, and I'm at North Myrtle Beach, and I'm here at a tide pool. And I'm really excited to find hermit crabs in here. And they're colonizing or living inside a whole bunch of different shells. And it's really cool and really fun to watch them. So today, I'm gonna to tell you a little bit about hermit crabs and share some really cool close-up photography of hermit crabs in action. Right here in your backyard, you never know what you're gonna find. I really enjoy coming to this section of North Myrtle Beach. It has a really nice campground and it's really quick access for me from the Appalachian Mountains. I can get here within five hours. It's also beautiful because I can walk away from the crowds and hotels and in a mile or two I'm here at this beautiful inlet where this uh, river comes down. Today during low tide I came across this tide pool. I looked down into the clear water and saw some little shells exposed on the sandy bottom. Then suddenly I noticed the shells were moving and I was delighted to find hundreds of hermit crabs across this little tidal pool. There are over 1,100 species of hermit crabs. A small number live on land, but most live in the water like these little guys. Hermit crabs, of course, are best known for occupying the shells of mollusks or gastropods. Hermit crabs don't grow these shells, and nor do they kill the mollusks to get the shell. They go out and find these empty shells to live in. While the anterior front part of the hermit crab has a hard calcium-based exoskeleton, they also have a soft, spiraling, unprotected abdomen designed to fit the spiral of gastropod shells on which they rely. Hermit crabs are decapods, which are characterized by having a jointed exoskeleton and five pairs of legs. The five pairs of hermit crab legs are assigned a division of labor, the first pair are modified as claws for use in defense and shredding food. The second and third pair of legs are used for walking. And the last two pairs of legs are never seen because they're deep inside the shell and are used to hold the hermit crab firmly inside. Hermit crabs are misnamed because they're not actually hermits at all. They're surprisingly social organisms and often occur in groups of over a hundred individuals. Hermit crabs are fun to watch and can be frequently seen interacting with each other and often downright fighting. Suitable shells for hermit crabs may be in short supply and can be a limiting factor in their populations. In order to grow, hermit crabs have to trade up to larger shells. Sometimes hermit crabs will fight one another in an attempt to steal the larger, more accommodating shell. Hermit crabs are omnivores, feeding on a wide variety of foods including plankton, organic detritus, or any dead fish or marine organisms they may come across. They can use both their claws to pick apart and consume a dead animal, or they can filter out food material from the water column. The shells of hermit crabs often have hitchhikers attached to them, including barnacles and sea anemones. These organisms may provide some camouflage for the hermit crab and perhaps a level of protection as some hermit crabs will remove sea anemones to reattach to their new shell as they move on. Hermit crabs are fascinating creatures and so fun to watch. I hope that you'll get an opportunity to see some of these intriguing little guys in action for yourself. Well, I hope you enjoyed watching this seaside episode at Nature at Your Door and learning a few things about hermit crabs and watching what they do. I had really fun doing this episode, as I always do, because I love sharing what I find with you. Remember, if you like my channel, you like what I do, please subscribe, give me a like, and leave me a comment. I love hearing from my viewers and interacting with them. And remember, I cover all things nature, from frogs, toads, snakes, turtles, the myriapoda, insects, trees, wildflowers, and fungi. I cover all the things you might encounter just outside your door. So this is Frank Taylor, Nature at Your Door. Thanks for watching my channel today.